We are the Church of the Holy Sepulchre in front of the tomb of Jesus. Um, that church has been destroyed so many times that the structure that we see here is from 1809. It's been destroyed 1808 uh, by a fire. And the dome collapsed and destroyed the site itself, which wasn't the original site because that church has been destroyed like a million times. The tomb himself is, for, of course, from the first century, but the Romans built on top of it a Roman temple. And only when St. Helen came, the mother of Constantine, she built here the new church. The structure is new and they are renovating it. It belongs to everyone, to the Catholic, Greek Orthodox. Um, uh, actually, the Greek Orthodox are holding it, but, they are, but they're, they're, the Catholic and the rest, Armenian, Maronite, they've got rights as well. In that case, to decide who, how to renovate, it took them only 200 years. Now they're doing it. This is my family that entered now to the tomb itself. And let me see if I can actually help my camera, hold my camera above, and then you will see a little bit more than that. Now, the site itself is divided into two. Let me take a picture, and then we'll see it. All right, the two. The first part, just behind that door, is the angel chapel. They took care that no one will steal the body of Christ. In the inner part, you can see now the people there. That is the tomb himself. Mm. The st structure itself is now naked. I mean, there's no pictures, lamps, and icons on top of it. I'm sure that when they will renovate, uh, they will see it again. And then this is history in process. We are at December 11, 2016. I'm sure that in about a few months, it will be already done. I wonder how it looks, will be look like. 